Hello guys and welcome back to another Disney Heroes Battle Mode video. In today's video I want to be talking about Jack Skellington. Skellington and this entire update guys. Once again this update has done the impossible guys. It's done the impossible. It is once again crap. The whole update is once again ruining Ruin the game, as it always does, guys. Every single time they release an update, you know how much I get annoyed about everything. That it just seems like everything they do makes the game worse. So, first of all, what they did is mucked up all the badges on the heroes. Which, I don't know how they managed to do that, guys. They weren't even updating the characters. So, what happened was that about 50% of the characters had their badges somehow put on wrong. So, Zerg... One of his badges were replaced for some reason, and this badge here was accidentally a different badge, so anybody who had this badge equipped, they took off. They just, poop, gone, removed it. Absolutely just, just, just popped it off, guys, like it was nothing. So, with ease, they just knocked the badge off, and that was that. And then all they did, like, to return the favour was a, a little a little message that just said, sorry guys, have no rewards, your badges are gone, brilliant. So, and they still haven't fixed some of the most basic stuff, guys. So when you're on a hero, I might not do it, but when you go onto their skills and you click there, see, it goes back. So when you're mashing the button here to put the skills on, it goes back. Really annoying. Very very small thing, but it annoys me a lot, guys. I'm not here. I'm not here just to whinge, but you get my point. Um, now they've got Eve power up. Okay, fair enough. That's the next character they powered up. And don't even get me started, guys, on the event that they've done. As um, as a couple of us who call it in the Disney Heroes YouTube community, fortify the wallet, guys. Can you win this one? No, I imagine you will not be able to win it unless you have your wallet fortified or you've won the lottery, guys. Getting to a million on this, you have to spend like 24,000 diamonds or something unreal. Absolutely unreal, guys. The amount that you have to spend to get anywhere doing these challenges. So I can't stress that enough how annoying these challenges actually are, guys. Just in every single way. They are unbelievably annoying. So, like I said, oh, this is such a bad one. Especially after an update, they could have done one to do a Jack Skeleton or Sally or something. But the rewards are good, but that's because they're impossible to get, guys. Like, I can't stress that enough to you. These are good rewards. I'm not knocking the rewards, but I'm knocking the contest itself. And the rank 1 rewards as well are incredible on this, guys. Like, that, that I'm not knocking. I'm not knocking the rewards because they are they are pretty good guys they are pretty good it's just oh like come on come on what are you guys doing is basically my point that they're they're just taking the piss with this guys they are taking the piss so well we won our guild war though so i'll open those crates in the video and i'll do my sabotage phase so right what i want to go into today is a little bit about Jack Skellington, guys. So let's find him. Let's find Jack Skellington. Where is my man Jack? Where is he? There he is there. Lovely. So, we've got Jack Skellington here. Yes, he is unusually laggy for some reason, guys. I don't know why, but he just lags. So this is another brilliant thing about this update, guys. Um, this, is, this video is a bit of a rant, guys. Just the last updates have just been terrible. And there's no, there's no other way to say it, guys. The updates have been bad, and they never seem to make any difference. They never try to make them good at all. And it, everything seems rushed, even though they have so much time to do it. But yet, every single time they get an update out, it's just rubbish. So... Let's discuss a little bit about Jack. Because he does seem like he's a good character, apart from his entire moveset is really laggy. And that's even on my phone, guys. It's it's laggy everywhere. It's just weird. They haven't made the character properly. 
I haven't seen him in combat. I don't know if anybody's got him. Um, I, if, I, if they did, I'd imagine they'd put him up for show. But it doesn't seem like any... Ah, here, someone's got Jack Skelling here. So what I want to do is put Jack Skelling against a character who isn't overly that great, just so we can see him. So let's just put him against, I don't know, Judy. Let's see what happens. Let's watch Jack. So he actually lags as well in game. Let's rerun that. Just watch him. No, he, he works alright in game actually. He he seems quite cool. So obviously if you hit an enemy at the back, that duck will run through and kill all of them. He seems quite cool guys, but it's just another sort of like you know, like do I need to get this character? Do I need another character in game I'm like guys I'm not complaining that then that I'm happy they're adding characters it's just uh, they could be a little bit more helpful um, and if, if, if guys if you're releasing updates please just make sure you you know you play test this game look send me the updates before you release them and I will tell you every single thing wrong with it every single thing wrong because I spot it out because I play this game a lot not just because I like making YouTube uh, videos for you guys but I play this game a lot and every single time it's broken guys it's always broken and I don't know how you manage to do it I don't know how a company like Purblu who have got experience in this industry can break the updates every single time and it stresses me out because they're releasing this to 10 million people an update 10 million people have downloaded this game and they can't maintain it. All they can do is add stupidly overpriced deals to the shop every time there's an update. They make sure that goes right, I'll tell you. But anyway, let's get back to the characters. So I want to do a quick overlook of Jack. Here he is. So I want to look at his skills, Master of Fright. Jack sets his pumpkins aflame, making his basic attacks do fantastic damage while dealing an additional damage dealing additional damage over three seconds so it adds a little bit of burn damage which sounds quite cool jack twists his face into horrible sights scaring enemies for six seconds and stunning them for two the scare and stun have a chance to fail against enemies one above us because it hasn't been upgraded so this is quite cool because we've got passive and active and these are the only two characters in the game that have passive and active so that's a new thing so i wouldn't knock that that's new that's decent guys if we skip over what's this jack throws a present at the furthest enemy and Terrifying duck toys emerges, so the duck comes out and it runs across and it damages every single enemy it hits. That's good, guys. I'm not knocking that. That sounds like a good move. Cool. Uh, Jack engulfs himself in flames for 10 seconds, causing his basic attacks to do splash. So that's good. So for 10 seconds, every single move he's doing is going to hit the entire team. It's going to have some sort of splash effect on it. So that's pretty good. Trick or treat. Jack and his allies heal 98 HP whenever they're damaged. So if you were to have Sully on... Uh, he'd scare everyone, then you had Zerg shooting. Now this is why I wanted to unlock Jack Skellington, because we could have him absolutely rinsing, and it would be so cool guys, it would be insane, just watching him absolutely take down everyone, it would be so cool. So I reckon he'd be a really good combo with Sully and, um, Sully and Zerg, I couldn't think of the name then. So I'm, I'm going to open a crate, and let's see, let's see what we can get. For Eve, I'll open one more. For I'll open one more. So that's not really that great, guys. I know I'm not going to get lucky to get Jack, but I would really like Jack because, like I said, that skill would be insane with Sully and Zerg. It would be such an incredible skill. So I am looking to try and get Jack Skellington. But I don't want to go mental and like use 70 crates on him. So let's, once again guys, this arena merge is absolutely pissing me off. Uh, sorry, peeing me off at the moment. Oh, this game's angered me today, guys. This game has angered me today. More than it should have. More than it needs to. It's just annoyed me. And the arena mergers are getting, uh, getting right on my nerves as well. Because I keep getting in first to move up the ranks. But every time I sit in first, guys... I immediately lose everything. So uh, it annoys me that I lose everything when I get into first. So there's not a lot I can do, unfortunately, because I get stuck in um, in.
basically, you'll see here, right, I'm first, and I'll stay in first for about 15 minutes, and then the arena will merge, and I'll just get shot back out. And it is really annoying, because it keeps happening to me. So I'm I, unab unable to get anywhere decent in the um, arena, unfortunately, and it does annoy me a bit. Uh, so let's go into the Coliseum. I can't beat this guy at the moment, but we'll we'll give it a go and we'll see what happens. But yeah, there doesn't seem to be a way at the moment for me to beat this guy. Yeah, he's proper. He's had the top of the arena for quite a while. He's had that arena for a while, guys. So it, it's pretty decent and fair play to him. Um, I'm going to be a very long time as I can catch up. Very long time until I, until I get to where he is. Um, okay, so I need to buy that. Complete it. Who was I farming in these? I was doing Stitch, wasn't I? So let's go, let's go back in and get some more. Yeah, I was doing Stitch. It's, it's annoying because it seems like you can only get... I'll get one from this. Yeah. It seems like you can only get one. Uh, you can only get three. So you get one guaranteed per three. And then if you don't, if you get two, the next one you're guaranteed none. Don't know if that's weird, but every time it's happened to me, it seemed to have followed that sort of way of thinking. And it's really annoying. Guys, really annoying again, I must say. Because they just, it, they shouldn't, shouldn't do that. It shouldn't do that, guys. Because it just seems like they've made that pattern so everybody wastes their energy and stuff on it. Uh, what else was it? I'm going to be doing a City Watch very shortly. Um, oh, I just hope... I wonder if I can win. I'm going to be doing that on hard, guys. I've reset it on hard at the moment. I'm going to do that in a separate video because a lot of you have wanted me to start again on my City Watch. And um, I appreciate that, guys. And I will definitely do a whole video on it because you want to watch me go through it while I've been struggling a lot on City Watch. And I'm just hoping that I can finally get through City Watch. But it could be a little bit of a struggle, guys. Like I said, because I've just been struggling so much on City Watch at the moment. Because it just seems that like I get to third. I get to the third chapter. Then the third battle. Every single time. Can't get by it. No matter what. I cannot get by it. Every single time I get stuck on it, guys. And it's weird because I don't know why that happens. I don't know why it, it needs to happen. It's, it's very annoying, guys. It's very annoying. So now I've got my surge unlocked as well. I'm start doing some surge battles. I don't know if in the market. Um, I could do my next set of friendship missions, which I might do very shortly, guys. Um, so let's go back. Let's just have one more overlook at Jack, guys. I am quite looking forward to getting two new characters, especially Jack with his heel, because that would just work so well, insanely well with Mister uh, with Quora as well. It would, so who would I swap him out for? I'd probably. Oh, I don't know who I take off. Might take off uh, Calhoun. Because I have Zerg, Scar, Calhoun, Sully. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So then I can put that on. So I'm hoping to get him, guys. But I'm going to end this video here. Bit of a rant today, guys. I apologise. But for some reason, you guys like to watch me rant. So I hope you've enjoyed this. I will see you guys in the next video. As always, guys, join the trial family. Help me hit that 3K mark. Comment down below, guys. Join my Discord and I will see you guys in the next video.